Cranking her up one more time for the Turkey Day Getaway. Welcome back, myself, Credence, and Mikey. We got a chase special holiday edition with how is she going to fry a turkey inside of that house? I mean, I've never seen a dog drive this good. This is the first time <laughs> most dogs right off the road hitting other cars. This one keeping it pretty straight and narrow. I'm impressed right. already. Certainly can't forget this one. I, the the amount of garbage and things just hanging out of this vehicle is astonishing. What do you think's in the boot? Uh, the boot can't even be closed. I can't imagine. I don't know. I did to get hit in the rear. I and then and then he got something out of the passenger side that almost looks like a. I thought it was an I ironing can't. board, maybe or something. I don't know. <laughs> Well, uh, it's just crazy. <laughs> Keeping it to the curb. I like that. But man, this car. Oh, back tire. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Now you pull over and get a little air in that. What's with the uh, curtain hanging out, Dave? Like, what? You got to have curtains in your house, man. I mean, come on now. <laughs> oh, my God. Dog happy as can be. <laughs> it looks like there is, except for where they're at. There's no room at I think all. Like, yeah, I think they're driving like this. Oh my god. Absolutely goodness. crazy. I, are we a junk collector or are we living in this car? Or I, I I like to think that this is full of collectibles. Um <laughs> yes. collectibles there's a bunch of is. uh what do they call those hummels uh, all in the car, the little yeah. statue figurines. <laughs> Maybe some of those glass face dolls that you could buy on QVC. Maybe some of those are on there. Man, that's crazy. It's Glenn. Glenn? Lots of uh, beating and banging on this car, too. I, I... This car is almost like those snowshoes of Knox's that he says, Man, if this side is a hair, snowshoes could talk. Somebody asked Ooh, him during the. Uh, yeah, during uh, one of the OG shows, they asked about the snowshoes in the back. And it was very standoffish, Gore Point. was very standoffish about, I guess, that there's a story attached to them. Like, he was, yeah, basically saying, boy, if they could talk. The way he was talking, there's a body attached to him. <laughs> yeah, like he committed a murder. Like, he's hide, like he used those snowshoes to walk out and dump the body or something. You ever heard of the snowshoe killer? Oh, that tire is. Oh, uh, that tire is completely gone. It's entering into another dimension. The way yes. it's moving right now, I believe it's teleporting. Oh, so, oh don't lose anything. Yeah, careful. Things are gonna start popping out. It, 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 that almost looks like those uh, cheap. Uh, the thing hanging out of the side almost looks like a, a wall mirror, uh, like the back of a wall mirror. I don't think maybe. It is. Maybe they put that out to get ready for today's look. Beautiful work of art sticking out of the back. Yeah, a skeleton? Uh, yes, perhaps. I, I think that that is uh, part of their uh, Halloween decor that they're uh, getting rid of. Maybe they're selling their art. Maybe there is a uh, body wrapped up in that sheet, and that's a portrait of it you can now purchase. Oh, there we go. One hubcap. Uh, nice. Free um, to a good home. The amount of garbage. I, I'm used to seeing the dash filled with like cigarette it's boxes. It's the car part. And like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like mail, you know, sure. things like that. This is just straight up garbage. And uh, look at the. <laughs> the wheel is destroying the car. That tire hated mm. being on this car so bad it will take Wouldn't a piece you? of it with them. Oh, I, I don't blame it. Maybe those are old air fresheners on the dashboard. Maybe it's <laughs> <a> really nice. <laughs> uh, Amazing. I can only imagine the amount of stuff. Oh, oh easy, Poochie. At least yeah, the dog so is wearing a seatbelt. So here's the thing. Uh, when a vehicle, when a vehicle like this is, is in a, uh, law breaking situation, do you not have to write down all the, uh, stuff that's in it? Right. Oh, yeah. You got to go through the entire car because for contraband, that's an extension. I guess it's like an extension of your property, if you will. It's a crime scene. 
So everything in there has to be logged. I don't know how you do that. I, yeah, and just searching the car, no less. I, I couldn't imagine having to even think of attempting to do that. There might be All children right. hidden there. Whole well, family there living in this Yakety sacks ready. Is that what you're saying? Maybe. If this car stops and something pops out of that trunk, I would not be surprised at all. But yeah, you think they're still making payments on it? That's the question. You know they are. Oh no! Oh no! It's really getting damaged. Has it ever been insured since it's been owned by this person? They have homeowners insurance on it. (laughs) Yeah, this is this might be it. Wouldn't you love (laughs) just a solid hour? This is a woman, right? Isn't it a woman? Yes, this is a woman, yes. A solid hour. I would pay a hundred or two just to talk to this woman. Nope, she's moving that thing in the window. I see it moving around. She doesn't want it to fall out and get broken. Oh, yeah. That would be seven years of bad they luck. It's just jostling it around, <laughs> moving. Mark, what happens with that dog if she has it leashed or Who let the dogs out? It's it's sad when the dog is probably the smartest person in the car. Nah. <laughs> the dog is even like, look how you live. Is is it possible that is it possible that that's the same dog from the RV and she had to uh, downsize to the car? <laughs> the same lady, right? <laughs> Back on the road with Poochie. Could you imagine if she stole this car and this was any her stuff? It was just a car full of shit she stole. <laughs> All or nothing. They're letting these uh, vehicles very close to this scene. Anything can happen. This dog can I, turn on them. Anything. This one, uh, I definitely could see myself getting in a rubbernecking accident uh, or at least uh, attempting to look a lot at this one because that one would get my attention. (laughs) Maybe the red thing is uh, a flag and this person has declared themselves independent of the United States and now has formed their own government right under the roof of that car. That house is a sovereign nation is what you're saying. It could be. It could very well be. They may now (laughs) need to send in a, uh, a diplomat to talk with the dog. Need to send in one of those auditors on YouTube. I told you that he, that the one that rode around the bicycle, uh, his whole channel's gone. Did I tell you that? You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, you told me that. Yeah, still gone. There she is. Look at yeah. good. Yeah, baby. Yeah, make sure that door is closed. Ooh, let Adjust me fix my top, baby. Does she have on a mask? <laughs> I don't think she even has shoes on, Creed, so I don't nope, believe she's barefoot. So. She's barefoot wading. I'm going to sit right here and you boys drink okay. in the hotness <laughs> that is me. I think she's trying to sit on the curb. I, no, I'll just sit here. I ain't laying down on that. Yeah. Nah. Uh, what's that, sir? Oh, what, what? So, what do you mean? Okay. I'm going to guess. Sweet ink, by the way. A little mental illness, maybe. I mean, you get out of a car after a low speed chase, you just walk up like, is there a problem? How's it going, fellas? Uh, yeah. Hey, guys. Hey guys, just, let me keep pulling this up for you guys. You want to pull me over to check out my swink, sweet ink. <laughs> <laughs> hey, see on my back shoulder blade, uh, that's a radio antenna. Yeah, what do you think of that, huh? Huh? How's it going, boys? Saw so you pulling me over. <laughs> just look at all this stuff. World's best dog. My dog would already have lost yeah. its mind. Well trained car dog. God, I wish I just wish we could go through that. Uh I just get a little closer, put a mask on, just take a peek inside of what's happening there. Don't make them like that anymore. Yeah. Beautiful girl. Young oh, lady. She's a beaut. Hey. S- Set the car on fire. Get the dog out and just burn it here. <laughs> burn it down. Even, Get the dog out first. The burn. Not even going to take it in. We're just going to set it on fire. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, is a code for Turkey Day Getaway continues Ooh. again. Want to remind you. Uh, coming up at 10 East, Knox's first ever. It's the grand finale. He's doing a show. Uh, Mikey called it uh, an extravaganza. 
It is. It truly, truly is. Uh, you, you'll get to see a side of Knox you knew was there the entire time, but maybe you didn't want to admit it. So make sure you tune in for that. Lots of great stuff. If you've missed any of the earlier shows, go back and watch them. We did one every hour, 12-hour marathon, culminating with Knox. And then myself yeah. and uh, Credence coming on 11, going to do a little giving away, a little return to the family. Uh, um, thank you for joining us. Oh, they're getting away from your heart. I think he's scared of the dog or scared of the whiff coming out of that car, I would imagine. I, does she take the time to leave the car to number one, number two, or number three? I'm guessing right in the car. I don't I'm think there's any reason to even get out. There's probably a section of the car that is uh, designated for excretions. Uh, is she classy enough to use one of those cups that turns it into like a male uh, thing so that you could make your own trucker jug, if you will? Yes. She has a funnel and a a cord. Yeah. Uh, do you think that she just uses the the free f uh, paper funnels that you can get at the gasseterias? No, oh, she's far classier. Now it's a ninety eight cent plastic one from the Walmart. Uh, by the way, if that car wasn't beat to crap, it, it actually would be a fairly nice car. I mean, it's not. You know what I mean? It's definitely, uh, definitely uh, different. Special, some would say. I'd like to think of it as just uh, eclectic. Do you think any of these uh, cops are going to pretend that they are very sick and have to go home at the moment so that they don't have to deal with the rest of that? I have a feeling many of them will get sick from this car. I think I think that you are absolutely correct. All right, guys. See you uh, next. Next hour. Oh, the hour. I didn't know what you was getting ready to do there. See you something. All right, guys. Until next, next time, Tuesday. look at these uh, beautiful cones and remember... One lane only to exit vehicles there. And the dog staying nope. in the car. That's good news. <laughs>